doing, guys? It's an ugly day in New York. It's pouring rain. It's 50 degrees. Hope all is well. Going to a no-heat call in southern Westchester County. Uh, we'll see what it's all about. All it says is no heat. It's a new customer, so I don't know, even know what type of equipment. Um, the town that we're going to is usually gas, but who knows? Uh, natural gas. It could be anything, though. It could be, for all I know, it could be uh, running on vegetable oil. <laughs> Cooking oil. But now we'll see what it is when we get there. And um, hopefully wherever you guys are, the weather's nicer than this. Because this sucks. Let's go. How you doing? Good. How can I help you? What's up? You good. You yeah, I remember you. How are you? What's going on? The boil levels on a star and they stay like a half an hour and they stop. Supposed to do that. Huh? Supposed to do that when it gets the temperature. No, but uh, it... He serviced it? Satisfied. So now let's go to the thermostats. Mm -hmm. the thermostats three. It two. Two. Okay. Let's go to both. The other one we are. I can I have it here in the dough. My phone. Okay. So this is still calling for heat. That just satisfied. So now we're gonna call for more heat. Let's go to the other downstairs. The thermostat I just did. The one upstairs that your tenant you can't get into is not calling. Look. This one's off. Okay. So this is going to cycle water throughout the house. Uh -huh. Then this temperature is going to come down below a certain set point mm -hmm. because it wants to satisfy the homeowner or whoever's living in it. Mm -hmm. And then this will kick back on by design. Tenants, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, go back. This one? Yeah. I never use this garbage app. First floor? Yeah. Give me, uh, put, put it up to 75. Feel it kicking on already. Okay. Yeah, seventy five is fine. It's coming down as we circulating water right now. Both the sides. But I like it. Okay. Cold in, hot out because he just turned the hot water on. Okay, and again, that's priority over there, and then you have zone two, zone three. Give me my thing, please. My cat cell J Claw. And we had the war. Mm -hmm. Guys, this is a call of uh, no heat. Tells me it runs, then it shuts off. Well, as I showed inside of it. I don't think it's ever been cleaned since day one, ever. I'm not here to do a maintenance. I'm not doing a maintenance. I'm just gonna get him going by doing a couple things and then we'll have to schedule a maintenance. So we got a bunch of calls today. Joke. Fucking piece of shit. Excuse my language. I mean, who does this, dude? Many years, years. Years, bro. Just wondering why he's not heating. Really, guy? Ah, oh, boy. Getting too old for this stuff, baby. 125.80. There we go, buddy boy.
things are shot. I don't even have new electrodes in the car. He said, yeah, my my uh, boiler just stops heating once in a while. Really? When was the last time you had maintenance? He said, a month ago. I said, really? And then when I opened it up, I said, a month? He goes, well, he just vacuumed it. I said, what, like that top? I said, who did it? He said, oh, a friend. I love the friends. one see that nozzle Jesus Christ yeah, well it's new here's your old one oh, yeah what is this ass look at this Oof. okay Yeah, no, it's strong, right? Te llamé y te estaba saludando ahí porque te estaba llamando. Aquí. Something you find on Mars. Okay, okay. Pues nada, tú lo. Okay. Hunter. Anda para carajo. Ah, no. Pues está bien. Yo voy a apuntar tu teléfono aquí. Power on. Wow. Yeah, it's coming down. Yeah, it jumps up and then it comes down to less than 50. I'm talking about buddy boy and see how low it comes down. Pull it apart right now. Here's your heat exchanger. The jacket cover. Thanks, Grandpa. Oxygen's too low, CO's too high. You got some this. So we got them down. We adjusted the oxygen. Um, 
got it down to I think 48 parts per million. Friday we are coming back to do, we're pulling that entire boiler apart to do a full maintenance. Obviously it's never had maintenance, but he just purchased a maintenance agreement and Friday between 12 and 4, there's going to be an oil tech that comes out and um, rips that thing apart and does it the right way. But uh, at least it's safe now. He's got the carbon monoxide detector. So he told me he pulled the battery out because it was going off. So I put it back in, made sure I tested it. We ran it for about a half hour. It's fine now. But uh, thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. And um, have great holidays.